What a wild ride we have had these past two years. As a university, we have managed the effects of COVID and what that meant for our campus community. We spent a year missing events, missing connection with our community, and learning how to deal with Zoom classes and meetings and with what was dubbed as the new normal. We did our best to show our prospecting students what life would be like on campus when they started at Northwestern as freshmen during our virtual Ranger preview event. Inside of Herod Hall, you'll find the financial aid, business and registry offices. Let's go take a look. We held a virtual commencement to ensure our students had a ceremony to honor their accomplishments and the time they got to spend here at Northwestern. And we even had a parade to show our students how much we missed them and that we wanted to wish them well and we couldn't wait to see them in the fall. This past year was dramatically different than the one before and we were able to experience a normal classroom setting and normal student activities. We lifted our mask mandate and it seemed to be a breath of fresh air for everyone. With CARES money, we were even able to offer incentives to our campus community to receive the vaccine. While the past two years have been inundated with COVID-related items, our university was able to experience great accomplishments. In 2021, Northwestern's Division of Education ranked among the top 85 most affordable early childhood education programs in the nation. And we were also able to invest $50,000 in scholarships for our teacher candidates who entered the classroom as secondary or special education students. Our ENA campus also partnered with Northern Oklahoma College to offer a fast track course of study for the completion of the elementary education degree so our students may earn an associate's degree and a bachelor's degree within three and a half years. Our nursing department also saw great rankings in 2021. Our online nurse practitioner program was named 13th best in the country out of 203. And the social work department was awarded a $40,000 grant to develop active learning environments for social work students. Through the use of CARES money, the university was able to make many needed updates to campus infrastructure. We have updated Wi-Fi capabilities on all campuses. Some HVAC equipment will be replaced this summer and the old power plant building was demolished to make way for what will become an outdoor classroom. The mall project is starting to take shape with new concrete work by Ryerson Hall and an updated look to the Student Center's west entrance. In late 2021, Northwestern was awarded more than $2 million for a Title III grant, which started our Office of Leadership, Academic Success, and Superior Outcomes. In 2022, our online nurse practitioner program was named the best in the country. And our Northwestern singers had the opportunity to perform at the Oklahoma Music Educators Association Conference and had pieces commissioned just for this performance. Over the past two years, athletics has benefited from the generosity of our supporters. Athletics received a donation from the late Jim Booth to renovate our athletic training facilities. The north end of Percival Fieldhouse received a renovation because of a group of generous supporters and Northwestern. This area now houses our Sports Hall of Fame members. Our sports teams continue to reach new highs each year and battle for recognition in the ever tough Great American Conference, including two recently named coaches of the year in their sport. One of our proudest moments this past year is when our athletic department achieved a 3.26 overall GPA, which is the highest in recent memory. We also created an esports venue that allows our students and that organization to have a space to compete against the teams from across the state. We now offer scholarships to these athletes. Recently, the Oklahoma State Regents for Higher Education held its meeting on our Alva campus, with many of them, including our new chancellor, able to take a campus tour. Showing our state regents the opportunity students have with us was a great highlight of the year. One of our most recent accomplishments was the production of The Music Man. The Fine Arts Department dedicated so much to create a successful musical with a cast and crew of more than 60 members. 
The community rallied behind the production with a full house for all three performances. Oh,